to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Stephanie. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. If you haven't yet, please go ahead and subscribe so that you can be a member of our YouTube family. And if you haven't hit the bell so you're notified every time I upload, please do that. It really helps me and it really helps my channel. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. It is very random. I went out and I purchased, purchased a lot of stuff, enough for this week's videos because as you guys may know, I'm only going out once a week to, to stores. I'm still trying to stay at home as much as possible. Still kind of scares me a little bit. I'm, I still wear a mask and all that stuff, but I only try to go out once a week when I need to go get certain items. This Dollar Tree haul is a little bit random. Next haul I'll put out on Wednesday, so if you guys um, make sure you hit the bell so you're notified, it's going to be like a huge Dollar Tree 4th of July crafting haul. I kind of went a little bit crazy, but I really want to do some 4th of July um, DIYs. And I also really want to do some like Father's Day DIYs or some gift basket ideas, so that's another video that I have coming up. So make sure your bell is dinged so you are notified when those videos come out. Anyways, enough blabbing. I'm going to go ahead and get started with the haul. I'm not going to go in any particular order. I'm just going to grab from my pile of stuff here. The first thing that I want to show you guys is I got, these are like the, they're, they just say filled glass candles. Um, it's a three-piece set. So this one says... Congratulations, soon to be misses. So these are like wedding candles. And I'm gonna show you what they say and how they look. So this is the first one it says, here, let me get them all out and I'll show you. This is the next one and then this one. So you can see here, you get three little cute candles in the package and it says, miss, to misses. I hope you guys can see that. <laughs> um, I'm not sure how they smell, but they're really cute. I think the packaging is really pretty. This one, it doesn't tell you what the scent is. And I don't know if it smells that great, to be honest. Let's try the yellow. Um, again, not much of a scent. Now I can't get the lid back on. There's really not much of a scent to these, you guys. They smell all the same. So I don't know if it's just supposed to be like for looks. There we go. But I just think the packaging is really cute. I think it'd be really cute for a wedding gift. And you get three little cute candles in here. And again, I, I don't know. I just think it's cute. I've never seen Dollar Tree really do anything like this. So this is definitely um, for a wedding. If I can get this shut. I struggle sometimes. So that is the wedding set. This one, it just says congratulations. And on the top here, we have three different candles. One says congrats. Woohoo! <laughs> and great job. And this is what the packaging looks like. You can see you get like a pink one, a blue one, and it looks like a black one to me. I really love this color combination. I think it's really pretty. So that's the next one. And this one says, time for cake, happy birthday. And that is what those look like. Again, I'm loving the color combinations. I think it's really fun. This lid says, have fun, yay, and happy day. So yeah, I really liked these. I thought they were cute. I'm going to keep them in my stockpile of stuff to give either in a giveaway or as gifts. I really enjoyed them. I thought they were cute. And then you guys... I kind of went a little overboard. So I seen this mug. I don't know if it's new, but I haven't seen it before. Um, it says, good morning, beautiful. I love the eyelashes. I really love this mug. And it's been a long time since I have I bought me a new coffee mug from the Dollar Tree. So I seen this one. I thought it was really pretty. But you guys, <laughs> I know these aren't new. And I know you've probably seen them at the Dollar Tree, but... I seen them, they disappeared, and I really wished I would have picked one up, but then my Dollar Tree got a whole new shipment in, and you guys, I picked up four. 
because let me just tell you how funny these are, how cute these are, like total mug shot. If you knew me personally <laughs> and some of my history and past, these are funny. These are really funny. And some of my friends, you guys know I'm going to make some of the cutest gifts out of these. I also have an event coming up where I think these would be perfect raffle items. So I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Put something in here, wrap them up all cute, and make some raffle items out of them. If you guys know, I am in recovery. I'm an addict in recovery. Now you might get why this is so funny, but... <laughs> um, in places like AA and NA, um, we tend to drink a lot of coffee. So just the whole idea, I don't know. I think it's perfect. I think I'm going to make some really cute raffle items. Like I said, I have an event coming up. And uh, we're allowed now to have, um, we're allowed to host gatherings of up to 50 people. So, yeah, I was just really excited to see these. I think they're cute. I think they're going to be adorable. I'm going to make a gift, put them in the raffle, and I think everyone's going to love them. So, all right, let's see what else we picked up. So this was kind of cool, you guys. Um, I've never seen Dollar Tree really have these. Maybe they have. Correct me if I'm wrong. But these are Beech Nut Fruities. Um, this one is, so it's it's stage two. So from six, from about six months up, pretty much. But um, my son is three years old. He just turned three. And sometimes he still wants these. Like, he still wants to eat them. But this is a name brand. I know they're more than a dollar at Walmart. So this is banana, apple, and strawberry. Yogurt, banana, and strawberry. Pear, mango, and squash. And then this is just veggies on the go. It says pumpkin, zucchini, and apple blend. And then I picked up another one of these because my son really loves banana and strawberry. So, um, there I, you know, I really just picked them up because I wanted to show you guys this. This is such a good deal if you have little ones. Um, to find these at the Dollar Tree again, they're name brand, so this is a good deal. Go ahead and grab them. Sometimes these pouches can be more than a dollar at Walmart, like I said, but my son, my son will eat them. So, wanted to show you guys those. And then another thing I picked up is the, I, I always get these, and these are the Kool-Aid. Last time I hauled, like, the, there was the Sonic ones, and then there was, oh, the Skittles ones. And they were pretty good. I liked the Skittles ones more than the Sonic ones. But this time we're going to try these. And the reason why is because this is actually what I'm doing. Um, we're, tra we're potty training my son. And this is what we're using as a reward. So every time he goes potty on the big boy potty, we give him a popsicle. A lot of the time I'll say, um, do you want to go to the big boy potty for a treat? And he knows that he's going to get a popsicle. So these have been working really well for me. And yeah, so this is what I'm using to potty train my son. It's working really well. It's going great. We're not quite there yet. Some days are good. Some days are not so good. If you guys have any potty training tips, Please help me out and leave me some comments. All right, grab those. And then my mom wanted me to pick these up for her. She really likes these. Um, she actually has a cleaning job where um, she cleans offices and stuff like that. She loves this stuff. Um, she lives by it, swears by it. She wanted me to grab her some. It says removes the toughest stains in seconds. This is the Lime Away. Destroys lime, calcium, rust, and basically, it's just a toilet bowl cleaner. And it is 16 fluid ounces. So I grabbed her two of those. And then, you guys, I found there was none left. I found this one bag. These are the big bags of, big bags of nerds. If you've seen my last haul, I'll go ahead and link it above so you guys can see it. I was stoked to find these because these are the big bag. This is my favorite candy. And the other bag went so fast that you know I had to grab another bag. Absolutely love these. All right. Grab some more of these. Um, I'm actually thinking about doing like a Dollar Tree review or like a trash talking video maybe on Thursdays. Like a trash talking Thursday. 
type of thing where on Thursdays I will maybe go over some of the products that I've used from Dollar Tree, whether I thought they were good or not. If that's something that you're interested in, let me know. I would love to do that. This is something that I grabbed at Dollar Tree not too long ago, and I actually really liked them. I use them on my, um, on my, I actually use them on my shoes and my kids' shoes, so I picked up two more of them. I think they work all right. We're going to give them a try on my kids' shoes, though, because, because those shoes are a little bit dirtier. Like my kids, I don't even know how they get their, well, yeah, I do, their kids. Their shoes are going to get dirty. So we'll see how these hold up against their shoes compared to how they held up against mine. But these are the shoe erasers. You just add water and it's to clean your kicks, your sneakers. And then I had to pick up some nail polish remover. I needed some. I finally got my acrylics off. Oh, it was, it takes so long and sometimes it's such a pain and it hurts so bad, but I finally got it off. Now I can start painting my nails. Um, there's still like hardly, I don't think there's any nail salons open where I am, so I'm just going to keep them like this, paint them, start doing my own nails again. Needed some of that. Where am I, you guys? <laughs> okay, and then I picked up some things for Father's Day. Like I said, I kind of want to do a Father's Day video where I show you some gift ideas or some gift baskets that you can make for your father for Valentine's Day. So I wanted, for Valentine's Day, wow, for Father's Day. Um, they had more. I think they had five different signs to choose from, but these are the ones I picked up. So I picked up this one. It says garage official rules. Measure twice, cut once, duct tape can fix just about anything. Dirt don't hurt. There are enough tools here. Don't act like one. <laughs> if it ain't broke, don't fix it. I think this would actually be perfect in my dad's shop. He has a shop. He's been a mechanic his whole life, so I think this is hilarious. Grab that one. And then this one says the dad zone, official rules. Sunday is for sports. Life lessons available upon request. No complaining. If dad can't fix it, no one can. It's another good one. The man cave rules. Official rules. Toilet seat stays up. Burping encouraged. If it itches, scratch it. Don't touch my remote and my cave, my rules. They also had one. I know there was a fishing one and there was another one and I wish I could remember, but grabbed these um, because I just thought they were really cute, really funny. And then I found these facial wipes. Um, these are the Nobleman, um, Nobleman, Nobleman, Nobleman. <laughs> Um, these are distributed by Global Beauty Care. The packing, the packaging on these is really nice. I think these look really nice. So this one right here is cooling. It's face and body cleansing wipes with aloe and eucalyptus. This one is active with, it's called active. It's again face and body cleansing wipes and with lemon and sage. And then this one is with eucalyptus and vitamin C, and this is for post-workout. So you could use it for your face, your body. I don't want to open them because I wanted to use them in a basket, but I think this lemon one was the one that I was sp um, smelling when I opened my Dollar Tree bags. I'm pretty sure it was this one right here. Um, I don't know. I liked the packaging. I thought they were nice. They're not a, they're not a Dollar Tree brand, so they're going to look really good in a gift basket. Had to pick them up. All right, you guys. And then I found these. Absolutely adorable. They just give me such su summer vibes. I just love them. So this one is my favorite. It's a cosmetic bag, and it is in the shape of a watermelon, and it says one in a melon. Squeeze the day, and it's a lemon. So adorable. And then good vibes, and it's a kiwi. I love this one, too. I love the summer vibes. Um, there was another one that said just peachy and it was a peach. I wasn't really feeling that one so I didn't pick it up. You guys, they had some new storage bins. Um, when you walked into my Dollar Tree, they had a bunch of different ones and new colors. Um, I really liked these colors. So this is like a really light blue. Really light blue. Absolutely love it. I love right here. 
the texture, and they're pretty good size. I mean, it says a one gallon, so 3.8 liters is how much it holds. So I grabbed those ones, and then these ones. And these are like a, what color would you say these are, you guys? I'm not sure. It's like a dark coral. <laughs> I don't know, what color are these? But pick those up, and my niece just got her own place, and she's been watching some of my Dollar Tree hauls, and she's like, I don't know how you do it. You find the cutest stuff at Dollar Tree to decorate your house and stuff like that. So um, I think what I'm going to do is maybe for a video, I'm going to put together like a housewarming gift basket or a housewarming gift um, from Dollar Tree and just try to make it look really nice. She likes the farmhouse vibe. And I'm going to see what I can throw together because I kind of want to give, give her a gift. So if that's something that you guys want to see for a video, let me know. I was just going to do it. But if you guys want to see how I put together like a housewarming gift, I will totally throw it in a video so you guys can see. But here are some of the items I picked up that are going to go in her little gift. I got her this crate. I need ideas, you guys. They had a lot of these crates and I need ideas. Let me know what would you make with these, what could you do with these. I know there's probably a lot of ideas, but it's cute, and when I see it, I know I have to have it, but I'm kind of drawing a blank on all of the things that I could do with it. So I'm going to put this in her basket, though. Um, I really liked it. I might get her a couple more. And then I've seen some canvases that I haven't actually seen before, and I really like this one. This says, Forever Blessed with Every Breath. And you guys know I just love the black and white check. The buffalo check. I just love it. I'm loving that one. So that one was cute. And then this one was also really cute. It says grateful, thankful, blessed. I love the colors. I'm loving that. All right. And then this last one here, it says home is where the heart is. And these were new to me. I don't know how long they've been at the Dollar Tree, but I was looking and I spotted these and I hadn't seen them before and I thought they would be perfect for my niece. So I grabbed those and then I also grabbed her um, some of these tins. So what I'm going to do, I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do, but this is farmhouse. I grabbed some of these tins and then I grabbed some lavender and then some onion grass. And I think I'm just going to make her a little, a little arrangement and we'll see. Anyways, you guys, that is all I have for this Dollar Tree haul. I hope that you enjoyed. Please come back on Wednesday for my 4th of July, huge 4th of July crafting Dollar Tree haul. Um, it's going to be a big one. And yeah, that's all I have for you guys. If you like this video, please hit the like button. And if no one has told you they love you today, guys, I do. Bye. Have a good day.